You're looking at a well-traveled superstar who has seen a lot in the ring. With experience comes confidence. There's nothing you can throw at this competitor that could phase him in the slightest. He'll be looking to utilize that wisdom in this matchup. Unfortunately for him, he can cross the ring from the young powerhouse and heir to a Hall of Fame legacy, Broad Breaker. If I told you what this kid accomplished just in the first year of his career, you'd think I was on hallucinogenics. The scary thing is, Braun has all the tools to climb higher, farther, and faster than his dad, or his uncle, ever had a chance to. An agile escape. Oh, and a big uppercut. It has to be demoralizing to just get slapped like that. Yeah, if that doesn't fire you up, I don't know what will. Knowing that Braun Breaker was literally bred for six months. Up top, almost lost their balance, but regained. side of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Into the barricade. Delivered into the barricade. That'll do it. Cheap shot right above the eye. And now gets tossed into the ring. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. From the top. But he doesn't connect. Reversal on top of reversal. One response after another. Back and forth we go. And finds a counter. What a shot. Just behold a sight we should expect for years to come. Braun Breaker taking over. Check out this display of power by Braun Breaker way overhead. The military press into the power slam. Does that hold it up for Breaker? He manages to kick out. What strength. It was almost all over, almost a three count. Yeah, talk about a close call. And Breaker cannot believe that wasn't enough to put him away. The suplex. Just a relentless assault from Braun. And I bet Braun is looking to inflict more damage, too. Oh, he retaliates. Oh, dragon suplex. He's on the ropes. The official sees it and waves off the pen. Look across the back of the neck. Headed up. He's thinking. sends a very clear message. Climbing the turnbuckle now. Uh-oh. Diving headbutt. Consecutive high-risk maneuvers, and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. Three, no. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Ryan dodges just in time. How is this superstar still in this match? Oh, determination. Looking for a change of fortune here. Oh, what a close line. Lakers on the edge of the feet. Can he respond? Finds the room to land the back elbow. what I'm seeing right now. No one can. Breaker now, getting in position. Ron Breaker, his strength on display. This is absolutely incredible. Will Breaker finish things now? of a second. Things must be rising in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. But yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. Series of reversals. There's a crucifix, nicely done. And Braun being hammered again. Breakers in danger now. 
And he tosses it back in now. is all up from the middle rope. Oh, a splash. Counters with an attack on Breaker. There's a crucifix. Nicely done. Oh, and Breaker turns the tables. physically and mentally, but to the victor goes the spoils. Triple threat bout here with Carmella, Aaliyah, and Roxanne Perez. Preparation will be key. All three competitors have to come into this match with a game plan. Have to come in with an idea of what it'll take to isolate an opponent. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. She avoids the contact. to the max. Beautiful back handspring sent on. Tagging this outside. This could be good. Oh boy. Kendo stick in hand. Nefarious look in her eyes. Sam Jawbreaker. You can pick up your teeth in the third row. Of a triple threat match can change at any moment. How would you suggest a competitor keep from being overwhelmed when that happens? I don't even know if that's completely possible, Cole. However, one should take advantage of the inherent no disqualification, no count out aspect of a triple threat match. Some might call it taking a shortcut, but if it's legal, I don't see why you'd avoid doing it. Face Buster! She's far from beating any of these three women could witness. Sit out slam. All measured up. Drop kick to the back. A quick finish. Can she do it? And there's a kick out at one. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. Temple's being made a target. Got dropped to one. Face first. Oh! 
ringside and back to the mat. She did. Well, that is a sign that definitely gets the point across. And some effective offense with that one. Comes back into the ring. Oh, man, by the hair. Hair whip. Things not going how she'd like. It's expected, Cole. In a triple threat match, the target on your back is twice the size. Perez on the receiving end. Delivers the bulldog. A set out mat slam. Keeping her inside the ring. Oh, knee drop. And now she's getting back into the ring. Held in a perilous position. <laughs> this match is wearing her down. Hanging tough as this match progresses. No easy task in a triple threat match. And planted them with a well executed DDT. And into the count. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. And Carmella with a takedown looking for a cone of silence submission. He's breaking it up at the last second. Oh. Ah, striking with a knee. Driven the shoulders down. This could be the one that does it for her.
quite the impressive victory coming out on top against two very capable, very prepared competitors. Three superstars absolutely giving it their all with one... The following is scheduled for one fall, making our way to the ring, representing Pretty Deadly from Prior Lake, Minnesota, Tiffany Stratton. Looking out at the countless members of the WWE Universe in attendance, they are all here because of matches like this one. Such an incredible journey for this woman, but she knows a win tonight will take her even further. A promising rookie in the women's division. And I'm sensing an edge to her. And from Chicago, Illinois, Cora. A bright future for this young woman. Yeah, but she needs to stop focusing on skateboarding and start getting mean. If Cora wins tonight, maybe she'll do some skating after the match. Or maybe she'll crack that skateboard over your back. Bell rings, and we have Cora Jade set for competition here tonight, once considered a perennial underdog, fighting an uphill battle in the women's division. Cora Jade has really shown a surprising amount of toughness as of late. Yeah, that toughness of Cora Jade is definitely an underrated aspect of her game, Cole. She may not look it right away, but you can't judge a book by its cover. Cora Jade with a point to prove in this one. And we'll see if she can remove the silver spoon from Tiffany Stratton's mouth. Show a little respect, Saxon. It's not Stratton's fault she's had a privileged life. Her athletic endeavors more than prove she's willing to put in the work. She dropped her like she was nothing. Hits the mark. Oh, God. Corey, there's no lack of confidence when it comes to Tiffany Stratton. How can her opponent shake that out of the buff beauty? While Tiffany certainly is a physical specimen, we've definitely seen her tantrums get the better of her. If you can control the match and set the pace, that'll surely frustrate her. And it's hard to be confident when you're frustrated, Whoa, Cole. Man. Two fists full of hair, this can't be legal. Oh. Win at any cost. As the wrist trapped. And this is just next level brutality. Oh. Oh, gets put 
into the barricade. Thrown back in under the ropes. She can end it here. Kicks out at just one. And those kickouts are only going to get harder. Oh, look at a torch of their opponent. Oh, this isn't going to be good. Oh, oh, man. Kick to the back. Hey, we're all getting free tickets to the gun show. Oh, man. Just a relentless assault from Tiffany. Tiffany is unloading attacks here. Continuing to brutalize their opponent's leg. The death lock is in. Ooh. Nowhere to go. Ah, oh, stops the legs. Looks like someone wants to shove Tiffany's silver spoon down her throat. Yeah, as Cora Jade's disproportionate toughness was on full display. Swinging neckbreaker connect. Close to over. Nice hip toss takedown. Great athleticism and a drop kick to finish. Tiffany is being taken full advantage of now. Yeah, as we can see, Tiffany's opponent's been able to control the tip. Putting a stop to all her showboating. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Oh, not everyone can do that. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Counter! And now there's an opening. Oh, reversal catches Tiffany. Answer after answer for each other's offense here. For schoolboy. She's starting to tire a little. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Manages to beat the count and get back in the ring. With no time to spare, really. Crashing down with the center. She can end it here. Strong kick out there. Yeah, she probably knew that cover wouldn't do it. Jeez. Oh, my God. Look at this. Boom, nice. Oh, Jade with good timing on the reversal. She returns the favor there. Suplex. of Jade making their pr oh reminding her that she did not come here to play games oh it is aggression just pure brutality come on easy just a relentless assault from Tiffany Corey's getting knocked back at every turn you can't take much more of this she's been on the bad end of a beating here and it's starting to show she throws her back in Top rope, here we go! Launching! Tremendous drop kick! Showcase.
showcasing her arsenal. A series of disabling maneuvers from Tiffany. That could be the spot she was looking for. Big form. There Uh-oh, this is just vicious, vicious arm stop. She's looking to go top rope. From the top. Jay Senton Bomb. Tiffany's on Dream Street. Cover. One, two. Oh, kick out, kick out at two. How close was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for her. You gotta give a lot of credit here. Withstanding what has taken out many other competitors. Steer clear of that. Big impact. Oh, step up his ear. Tiffany is being taken full advantage of now. Now we have to see how tough Tiffany truly can be. Jumps the elbow. Jane thinking she can close this one out. Straight jacket locked in. Boom, German suplex. Might have ended it with her opponent's biggest weapon. Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. Whip back into the ring. Oh. Referee's count stop. She stays in this. Just barely, Cole. Beautiful set time. She's got the shoulders down. And she fights it off. What does she have to do to put her away? I'm asking myself the same question. That should do it right there. And a strong kick out at one. Still has a great amount of fight in them. Not going to let it end like this. You've got to wonder how much has been taken out of these superstars thus far. And is there anything left? Look at this. Just stop it. Oh, she's staying elusive. into the corner. If you can get past the good looks, pay attention to the athleticism. Corkscrew, Stratton bomb. Stratton is just about to finish this. The cover. One, two, three, Tiffany Stratton comes up huge with the win. Here is your winner, Tiffany Stratton. Guys, it's rare we see such a closely contested match. After this win, you cannot question the heart and determination of this superstar. Well said, Byron. I don't think anyone will be questioning that from now on. Guys, with this match underway, you have to imagine that Solo Sokoa has some dangerous intentions in mind for this one. And of course, he has called the street champ is all about sending a message, and not a particularly positive one. Ferocious, dangerous, these are just a couple of words to describe Solo Sokoa. Some have also called him a menace, Corey. You do not want to get on Sokoa's bad side, but I'm not sure there's anything other than a bad side when it comes to this guy. And unfortunately for all of us, he's in there tonight with Sami Zayn. This guy is just a parasite and a cheat. He never met a shortcut he didn't want to take loudly. You are a heathen and a buffoon, Saxton. You call Zayn a parasite, I call him a strategist. Sami is always looking for the best path to victory, and he's pretty good at finding it. Does he cut a corner or two? Maybe. But you know what they say about ends and means. Big headbutt to the guts. He's returning fire. Boom, solo with a timely counter. Whoa, stiff headbutt. 
maybe one of the most scheming superstars in the WWE. You have to be aware that Sami Zayn is willing to do whatever it takes to get the win, legal or otherwise. Well, you call it scheming, Cole. I call it calculating. Zayn will definitely take every opportunity that presents itself during the match, so you have to limit the amount of chances that crop up for the master strategist. go Buster. compressing the neck with that kind of force can't feel good up high oh wait a second caught in mid -air. scoop slam pulls their opponent in belly to belly oh a wicked kick to the lower back And this one might be headed ringside. Whoa. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. Getting him into the corner. Right in the chest. What a drop kick. Effectively using the knee. He's taking some good hits. Oh. And that negates Zane's offense. Buster plants him. Oh! Ooh, well measured. Sokoa showing no fear up there. I knew what was coming there. On the top. Yeah. Oh. Down. He thinks he has it. Just gets the shoulder up. And frustration might be starting to set in. Uses the edge of the knee. And Sammy dodges that one. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Ooh, what a damaging blow. Look at this. Just will this be enough? He breaks the ref's count after one. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. <laughs> Telegraph that one and delivers a blow to the gut. Superstar exposes himself to. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. Solo Sokoa signaling to the audience, and they are responding. And they beat the count. Wow, so close. Oh, my goodness. Cover. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be pretty. Nice oh, suplex. Vertical suplex. Shortcuts from Sammy there, Saxton. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh, uh, let's just see where Sammy keeps his focus on in the long run. Jamoku driver. Yeah. 
as the ref noticed he was on the ropes. Was mounted with punches and not oh a nasty start to finish it off. What a battle we are witnessing. We're at a stage where someone's gonna have to shift it into another gear. He's been placed in the corner now. Solo reverses and looks to capitalize. Endless knee strikes. This was definitely a grueling match for all competitors. Looks like the Sammy Show continues to roll tonight. How do we get the Saxton Show canceled? Huh? The ring general Gunther ready to wage war in the ring here. Cole, there are so many metaphors to describe Gunther's abilities in the ring, and you went with the most obvious one. That's what I get for expecting anything more than average. For oh, this isn't good. This does not look good. It's all downhill from here, stalking their opponent. Oh, my. Don't do this. He's one step ahead there. Oh, close line. Gunther cuts him off. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Whoa-oh, monkey flip. <laughs> I love it. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Golly. Able to interrupt the attack. Go, go, go. And there's the takedown. Oh, God. Dodges out of the way. For a master tactician like Gunther, the path to victory couldn't be more obvious. He just has to choose his best strategy and put it into action. If he can do that, I'm sure this match will be going his way. Gunther's strategies have paid off for him in the past. Will it be the same case here in this one? Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Wrenching the arm, driven all the way down for a European arm breaker. Stopping that pain. And the forearm smash. This is a unique application of a hammerlock arm breaker. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. 
Gunther used that moment to teach him a very painful lesson. Great strength being shown here. And there is, there is nothing but malicious intent when you deal damage out on the apron. He's back into the ring. Gunther doesn't just want to fight, he wants to battle. Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful, but being slapped like that is humiliating. You would know, Saxton. Gunter from behind, looking to cinch it in. This one may be over. Good night. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't know how to shoulders down. This could be it. He's able to kick out before two. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. to the kidney, and again. Great way to wear down your opponent. And he's able to reverse. Well scouted reversal there. Boom, a forearm smack. Boom. And butt to the back of the neck. He's struggling a bit here. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Double stomp. All the momentum swinging away from Gunther. Gunther. Oh, 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 the Kimura. Kimura lock applied. Will he tag? He is doing whatever he can to break the Kimura, and he does. Counter on Gunther pays off. Quick return to the ring. And Guther clearly not impressed by his opponent thus far. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. He's back in so close to a count out. You do not want to lose that way. These consecutive attacks have been really keeping the pressure on.
What an amazing level of fight still left in Gunther. It is unreal that this match is still going on after a maneuver that went out most matches. These superstars have endured so much punishment. Certainly looking worse for wear, but the tide can shift at any moment. Gunther moved at the right time. The ring general delivering a powerbomb. Big opening for Gunther to take this. And Gunther able to get the win. Here is your winner, Gunther! That win took everything they had. And then some. These superstars took each other to the absolute limit. Well past the limit, I'd say. The Smash Mouth style of L.A. Knight should be on full display here tonight. Oh, yeah. L.A. Knight calls himself the last of a dying breed, and I have no doubt he's going to show all these dummies in the crowd why that is. It's definitely not a pretty style, but it's effective. And he'll be facing Santos Escobar, who has really taken a new approach to Lucha tradition. Some even say it's disrespectful that he gave up his mask. Definitely a break from tradition, but Santos has his eye on the future. He wants to ensure his heritage is survival, so that means ascending to the highest mountaintop possible. If that means he's got to walk over some bodies to get there, so be it. I don't know that there's a cockier superstar in all of WWE than LA Knight. First of all, it's called confidence corner. But I will admit, it could possibly be used against LA Knight here, because this match may just come down to who's more focused. Mm. Just stretching out the arm. That can prohibit any use of their shoulder going forward. Going for it. Going to step through. All on their belly. With, on his stomach. Busted crab. Busted crab locked in. His shoulders are down. No, a kick out. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Just like that, he said, crashing to the floor. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. This match grinded him down a little. Big forearm. Pow, what a shot. Carefully measured knee drop. Six. Six. Count out maybe imminent here. Really testing fate right now. That was almost a count out. Unloads with the boot. And he saw that coming from Knight. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. These two having an answer for everything. Oh, look at this. Hey, there. And he breaks the count quickly. Close call, but not enough yet. And that one misses the mark. He got whipped into that corner. Uncorked a big punch. Oh, what a counter. Connects on the kick. Oh, for the arm bar and a punishing stretch. An injured shoulder puts you below square one. This is a smart strategy here. He switches it back around. Oh, Santos counters. Look at this, going counter for counter. Big boot. And up the turnbuckles we go. From way up. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. Oh, that might have just broken something. He 
He's absorbing some tough hits now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes himself to. An impressive sequence from L.A. Knight. Yeah, Knight's smash mouth style is on display. Producing a trampling. Six. Got the single arm underhook. And one suplex. So hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Bad predicament right here. Oh, look at this worried look on the face of Escobar. This can't be how Santos envisioned tonight going. Can't quite get him there. Jordan suplex. And Escobar didn't see that coming. Power slam. Good night. Back in under the ropes. He's going to the pin. This could be it. And to the pay window. No kick at it, too. Somehow, some way, he is still in this. LA Knight DMT. Feeling like it's over for Santos. Two count. It's over. LA Knight is your winner. Here is your winner, And a very strong performance here from tonight's winner. A win like that proved he is not messing around. That match was all business from him, Corey, and that worked.